Hello guys. Thought I'd talk to you a little bit about cryptozoology. It's a study that I'm into. I've been in this since 1987. Very interesting subject. It's a Greek word. Cryptos, zoon, logia. It's the study of hidden animals. Um, get a lot of conspiracy out there about why haven't they captured one? Why haven't they killed one? And you get into what's called uh, telebiology, and what that boils down to in a nutshell, is it really necessary to kill an animal to prove the existence? And I am one that says no, it is not. Uh, especially when you get into biochemical research and DNA. Um, we've had visual uh, sightings, we have hair, we have scat, we have uh, prints. Um, there's many uh, accounts that's been made of like the Bigfoot creature um, and photos uh, just to give you ideals. Um, Bigfoot has really been fascinating with me. I had one eye-to-eye -eye encounter with him in 1987. I was about 19, 18, 19 years old when this happened. Um, ever since then, I got into cryptozoology, zoology, anthropology. Uh, telebiology um, and really took the research to extreme to prove the hidden facts of our universe and of our planet and the creatures that actually dwell here with us. Now we do get a lot of uh, controversy. I mean there is a whole bunch of animals that don't exist that have not been proven yet. There's a lot that have. Cryptozoology has brought many 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 animals to uh, the table. Um, give you an idea, cryptozoology covers hundreds of uh, different creatures all across the world. Um, there was an institute that was founded, you know, back in 1982. It's the ISC. It's the uh, International Society of Crypt Cryptology. Um, the meetings were held at the Smithsonian Institute. Um, the main thing that we're out here for is to give a sharper, clearer definition into the hidden secrets of our world and the animal population. Um, like I said before, many great discoveries have been made in cryptozoology. I just wanted to bring this out there and uh, give you an idea of the research I do. I'm going to start bringing a few of the, uh, the animals that are within cryptozoology that fall underneath the A to Z out there to you. This is one book out of my library. My library is three rooms. I have hundreds and hundreds of books on just about anything and everything of study over the years. Um, avid reader, my whole family reads. We're outdoor adventurers. I'm cryptozoology guy. Thank you for uh, subscribing to my channel. Stay with me and I will bring you some very fascinating stories, very fascinating uh, evidence on cryptozoology, anthropology to come. See ya.